But listen up and pay attention real closely. Because I know I got this reputation of being something like a mad scientist. Always doing these bizarre experimentations. But today might just be my Frankenstein. I'm going to take an ordinary horse and transform this beast into a bucking bronco, a world boss killing machine. Yeah, I'm talking about this guy right here. This rapscallion stallion. And what we're going to do, we're going to take this energy this mighty, he's got a mighty energy, full of might. Take this one here, it's got the all attack and defense 20%. We're going to take that one off. And we're going to swap it, get a zerg. We're going to swap it for this one here. This one's got something they like to call beat down. Because it, it lays a beat down. Smackdown beat down going downtown Yeah, so we're, we're gonna do some swapping back and forth crisscross applesauce Like a boss stomping grapes Yeah, yeah that's what we're gonna do. So but first we're, What we're gonna do is we're gonna take them into some different game modes, right? Just similar to what we did with, with Sentry except um, I'm more curious about like I'm going to take him into a quick Danger Room Extreme run. I'm going to take him into World Boss, obviously. Um, there's nothing else really I can compare. I mean, I could do a squad battle run with them real quick and see, you know, just like where his damage is at there. But nobody's using Beta Ray Bill in squad battle, right? I mean, let, let, let's be honest. So, let's first... We're gonna queue up a Danger Room Extreme run. Just we're just gonna spam invites here. I don't care who comes in. This is for testing purposes only. Yeah, buddy. What is he gonna is he gonna do the big circle? Or is he gonna do the three small circles? Right? If you saw the last video. You know what I'm talking about. Okay, we want to wait. We want to wait. We want to wait, 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 wait. Okay, can we kill him? He did. Okay, so in 17 seconds. 17 seconds. 42... 42 million in seven, almost 43, almost 43. You know, we'll give it like another, we'll give, give, give it like another run, right? But I'll just have to do the same thing with. That's gonna be a one shot, it's gonna be a one shot. Wow, wow, we. Look how much Raven matters. Wow. I think they got that. It's kind of broken. Not the most cool. Wow, Red Skull. Nice. Nice. I guess, you know, he's Blast, right? There aren't, like, that many good Blast characters that you could actually use. All right, so Starler's lead doesn't apply to a whole lot. Like, most recently, Moonstone, but before that, it was, like, basically just Sharon Rogers. What, Storm? You gonna bring Storm? Okay, so we can attack right away. He did the, he did the four circles. Okay, okay. Yeah, we're not, we're definitely not gonna one-shot him, but... So... Is that 15 seconds? 43 and 15 seconds? I think that was more. I think that was more. Yeah. All right, we are back. Just took my boy Beta Ray Bill into Danger Room, testing out with the original energy. 
yeah, I had, to, I had to go take care of some things. So we're recording this in uh, in a couple different sections. Uh, oh, look, I have a free character. Let's see how many bios we get. What do we get? What do we get? 48, not too bad. I mean, it, it, that's one hell of an increase from 8, right? Uh, oh, speaking of which, you know, well, let's uh, let, let's do this. Because I've been, I've been saving these to, to, to pop these. I never played this first one here. This one here, I never play that. Maybe you know, move in the future if I have the time, I'll, I'll start playing it. But I always play these three here. And there's one character that that I do not have that I really don't want to awaken, and that's her, Elsa Bloodstone. Not for this. Actually, out of all the, I played it every day, and there's only one day that I didn't get it. And what I do is I actually play this mission first because I have all the other characters. I played this mission mission first, and if I don't get the puzzle piece, then I just I don't even bother playing the other ones. Now I know you can get right like your daily reward, you can get tier three materials, but I'm not in, in huge need for those. But for those players who are, definitely play it. Um, but for me, it's more it's more of a time thing. So, anyways, let's pop these chests. Let's see what we get. I think we have we have four we have four pops here. Actually, we have four, five, and five on the other two. So let's see. Let's see if we get something good, something juicy. Oh, okay. Personally, I'd rather have the ISO. I know some people would rather have that, but you know, different strokes for different folks. Am I right? What are we gonna get here? More TCP? I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining, but I'd rather have the ISO. Come on, fully awakened ISO. And all right. I'll take that. As long as it's not purple or orange, I'll take it. Come on, come on, baby. Come to Papa. Oh, that one's ugly. That one's ugly. That's the worst one. But out, out of all those, man, those are some good rewards. Are you kidding me? Let's just move right down the line. Odin's blessings. Baby, come on, Odin. Bless me, baby. Bless me. For I am your son. Titan component packs. I, you know, that's better than any other just regular Mythic Guru. Come on, come on. Daddy's feeling like Daddy needs a new pair of shoes. EOD. Okay, again, better than a Mythic Guru. But not quite an Odin Blessing. More Titan component packs. My goodness. We got two more, guys. Come on. We need that Odin's Blessing. No. All right, I'd, I'd at least take the, the TCP. Okay, we'll take the TCP. I'll, I'll take it. All right. Now, moving on down the line. We have, we have five of these, right? Let's see. Combined fragments. Yes, we have five, baby. Five. You take, you keep five, you get five, and you take five. Whatever the hell that means. All right. A five star. I mean, five, I'll take a five star all day. But they do offer six star cards. Another five star. Come on, six star. I'm feeling lucky. Oh, and there it is. There's one six star. Can we get another? Come on, baby. Papa's thirsty. Not for that. We want that six. Give me the six. Show me the six. Oh, and he showed me the six. Is there, all right. Okay, enough of the funny business. Now, so where, what matters most to me, the reason why I'm actually making this change is to push null. So I'm currently on stage 22. It took me, it took me a while. I think it took me like upwards towards, I wanna say around like 50 minutes to clear stage 21. And that's with like my cards and my build. Um, and oh yeah, I want to mention. So I, I tried using Odin in that rotation. Um, I forget your name. I'll have to look it up in a, in a different video. I'll like announce this you know properly. But um, there was some controversy over Odin's rotation, and the one that I was given is better for damage. It, it is, and it actually puts you know Odin and Ghost Rider uh, much closer. Um, I'll do a you know a full you know proper comparison, but. Um, but it leaves them, it leaves them open more. So I find myself 
dying or being close to dying. So it's like you're kind of trading one for the other. But it is, in terms of damage, it, 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 it is better. But you might have to give them a, a healing striker then at that point. I don't know, again, like I said, I'll do I'll do a proper comparison. I just was playing around with it a little bit. But anyways, but yeah, clearing stage this high is a lot of work. It's a lot of work. I'm going to try to get 22 done um, tonight. I actually didn't do any of my world bosses. Um, Ebony Maw is my world boss. Um, but I'm going to, uh, I'm at least going to play two or three, um, no, and try to do 22 and move up to 23. It's, ju it's just a time thing at this point. Like, I know, like, the damage is there. It's, it's... It's close. It's close, and you gotta have really good luck with your procs, and you just gotta. You have to have a really good run. You have to be like on point, swapping in and out characters. Like you need to be creative to get this done um, this high. So like, I mean, I don't know how you could even go like much higher than this. Like unless like when you get to 25, you can use Moonstone or when they release new characters. But, I mean, there's not much more room to grow on my cards. Uh, I mean, yeah, I could have more Pierce. You could have max 25. I have 16 right now. Um, but as far as, like, attack, I, I can't get that much more. Actually, I think I have, the, like, the max amount of energy attack I could have on my cards. Like, so, yeah, these all have all attack. Well, two have all attack. Well, three, no, four. I'm sorry. Four have all attack. And this one has energy attack. And I'm using energy attack attacking characters. Um, but the only thing I get all blue here, all blue here, and all blue here. That's really the only other thing I can do. Um, unless, you know, I just get all seven quality cards, right? But anyways, okay. Just to give you guys a little insight into, you know, what I'm dealing with and what it looks like. So we're actually, we'll test this out. On stage 22 is the toxic meteorite. See, so yeah, yeah, and this one is a toxic meteorite, and that, like I said, if you use an Odin's rotation there, the the other one, it leaves them open a bit, and and the toxic, it just, it gets you, man, it gets you. What is 20? Toxic meteorite pentagon trap. Maybe maybe we'll do 20. And this is what we're gonna do. So I'm not gonna do like up to 30 bars. I'm just gonna do. I'm gonna do. A full rotation with awakening skill, and then I'm gonna go into five, four, or five, three, four, and then I'm gonna do that a few times, see where the damage lies, and then we're gonna, then we're gonna swap this, and we're gonna, we're gonna do it again. So I'm gonna give them strikers. Don't matter all that much as long as I keep them the same. All right, that proc was a little late. That's okay. Okay. And then five, three, four. So where are we? And he always does this right here anyway. So, okay, we're about three quarter um, on the 53. Let's try that again. We're going to do this. We'll do this a few times here. I'd like to keep this video on the shorter side for you guys. Because the last one I did was pretty long. So we, uh, I'm, uh, yeah, I'll just do this one because we won't see that much fluctuation, I don't think, with where the damage is going to fall here. It's probably going to be about the same. Yeah, okay, so we're halfway down 53. Okay, now I already did the, um, I recorded a little earlier, I got the, uh, I got the, the danger room for the all attack in, and let's, let's go and, you guys ready? Are you ready? Okay. So turning that that regular old horse into a bucking bronco, we're hoping anyways, at least for no. And it seems like just the difference on Sentry, although my card's a little bit different from when like I was really paying attention to where this damage was, but it seems like the beatdown works in Danger Room Extreme. But we'll 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 know more after I do some testing with this guy. And it'll be in this video. Okay. Enough chatting. We're going to unequip this. 800 crystals. Yikes. I hope I don't have to put this back on. Okay. We're going to lock that. Yeah. Yeah, we want to lock it. Yeah, I don't want that one. I'm, I'm going to have to re-roll that, unfortunately. Okay, let's equip this one here. Let's do it. Yeah, this, this one has a lot more ignore dodge. A lot more so 
don't know if that's something to consider, but in any case, let's let's go into. I'm curious about about no. I want to see this. I want to see this right here and right now. I'm in the dark just as much as you are. Okay, so we do need to run around. We need to get this up. Where's my energy? Oh no, you know what I didn't do? I didn't run around. Let's try that again. For the second time. But it seems... There's always, there's always some things you gotta... You know, get used to. Come on. Come on. Run, 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 run. And... Do you see that? Like, the proc is coming in so late. But that was pretty good damage, though. Like, better than... Okay. So, which one's... Yeah, I mean, it's definitely... It's definitely better. It's definitely better. that one up a little too. Yeah, I, I definitely did. We're gonna have to do this again. Okay, that was... Again, it was a little better, but... It's not a whole lot. It's not like a, like a crazy huge difference. And it could be... Part of it could be the ignore dodge. Like maybe if it had... Uh, oh my god. Okay, let's just restart that. Now I'm having just the absolute worst luck here. Like this wasn't happening for the uh for the other energy. Okay, run around, we don't want to get hit by the purple there, of course not. And the beatdown goes off like right away instant. So that was actually I think a good prop. Like that was a proper prop. Now we obviously want to charge this up and go into it but the beatdown didn't go off that time i mean what i'm telling you man if it's not one thing it's the other thing so the thing is if it's like if it's that close you might be better off just with you know a 20 percent all attack all defense because you don't have to run around them, right we don't want to get stuck by okay there's speed down and there's the prop i mean it's like three quarters to a half a bar difference so it's it's definitely better it's definitely better and you know just from that demonstration and it could kind of you know stack up as you you know go through the run and let me tell you at this high of a stage the little bit of damage it does matter. So that was excellent. What? Where? <laughs> I, I can't win. Like, you guys, I don't know if you're paying attention to that, but in the upper left-hand corner, there's the two um, there's two little boxes for, for each of the procs. Okay. Come on. We can get this right. I mean, this just seems like a huge pain to consistently get this. I mean, it's not that bad with Sentry. Okay, there's... Okay, I mean, that that's that's pretty good. Right? That's giving me a decent showing that it's definitely better. It's definitely better. And, you know, a half a bar at, at this... Or, you know, like three quarters of a bar at, at this stage... Um, adds up like especially i mean because i'm so high so that that half, the half a bar is actually a, it, it's quite a bit of damage so we we know it's better we know it's better let's jump into some danger room and i honestly like i can't recall okay so i need i need people to help me out here Yeah, it's a, it's a bummer. He he doesn't have uh, beta ray bill, but you know we'll we'll we'll, we'll see what happens here. All 
That beatdown didn't did not go off. I didn't catch the time, but I'll I'll, I'll look it over in the video. Um, my beatdown didn't go off for the second rotation. It seemed like the bar filled up. No matter who he brings in, as long as we have beta ray ability, that's all that really matters. And as long as the, the other character isn't buffing beta ray bill in any way. So let's hope we get it right this time. No stuns, no missing skills. And charging up the beatdown correctly. I just, I, I feel bad doing this, asking these guys to do this over and over again. Here we go. This is exactly what we want. But we got a late proc. Should have waited longer, I guess. You know what? I was only paying attention to... I mean, that seems pretty damn good to me. Knocking them down on a regular rotation all those bars you know that that's just that that's tough so we're gonna do what we can but it's it seems like it seems like it's it's pretty much on on pace it might be a little bit better might be a little bit better but nothing major okay we got it that time we got it that time we got it that time we got it that time. Awesome. I want to be able to give this to you guys properly, right? No outlying factors, nothing to influence the damage in any way. And it seemed like when I ran with the all attack that my damage was... Um, my damage, all of my damage was being registered, right? So this, this might be better. I think, I think this is going to work here. Is he going to do big circle or little circles? Okay. Okay, this could be good. This could be good. I mean, he's he's a done deal. That was that was that was excellent. Like that was perfect. So I think that's actually better. I think that is better because I'm gonna go check, but in the previous runs, I believe I went into another rotation. Like I actually, like he wasn't pushed down as far. So I, th I think that's better. It's just like I said, it's it's, it's hard to compare without running with the same team. But I, I think it, it I think it's better. All right, first and foremost, so I got to give a shout out to those who helped me with these Danger Room Extreme runs. Um, I know it's probably a little tedious, you know, running over and over again. So I got to give a shout out to these people real quick. Uh, let's see. So um, you, you'll see them in the runs, right? You, you'll see their names. But um, first and foremost, I don't speak this language. So I'm not going to pretend that I do. But this guy right at the top here with the uh, with the Groot, uh, Christmas Groot icon, he helped me out. Thank you, man. I really appreciate it. Um, Lala3EZZ, thank you too. I appreciate you. They both helped me in this, in the, um, you know, do the runs after I made the swatch or the swap to the beatdown. And then where is he? Mayhem in my hands. Um, he helped me before I made the switch. Him and um, the last one's not on my friends list. He's in my alliance. Uh, it's Improve MFF Cynic. Pretty sure that's it. Um, and I'm pretty sure that that Cynic Alex. 
Um, you know, he's, he's changed his name a couple times, you know, since like the, the whole boycott thing and all that. But thank you, man. I really appreciate you taking the time out of your day. All right. One thing um, I have to point out, because I was, I was just doing this, and I don't know if you guys are doing this, but I strongly suggest that you do, because I think that maybe they changed the rate that these are dropping, because I've never been this lucky before. And I'm talking about the combining Uru event right now. It's on for another five days, I believe. I'll double check. But I got one, two, three, four, five, six, and then one up here, seven. I got seven of these, and I didn't even really spend that much gold. Um, you know, I basically just, like, from playing Story Mission, I'm getting all those Mythic Guru, also from ABX, other sources as well. You probably have, you know, the energy defense, physical defense, recovery rate, and um, even more so now, like, if you have a lot of ignore defense on your cards or high dodge because of the crafted situation or skill cooldown or attack speed, you use those. That, you know, that, that's what I did. And I still have more left to do as well. I didn't even use... Um, I, I have a good amount, I have a good chunk, so I'm expecting to even get more of these. I mean, if I can, if I could walk away with, say, 10, I would imagine I'm, I'll get at least three more with the, how many I have left. So if I could walk away with 10 Odin's Blessings, that's amazing. So take advantage of that, guys. All right. Continue on. All right, guys, so trust me when I tell you, I did try to keep the length of this video down as much as I could, right? With, with still being able to provide you with, you know, some some footage and some gameplay to give you an idea of, you know, where where things stand with it. Um, I did do some additional testing, like off off camera, um, in Danger Room and in World Boss in Null specifically, and I'll and I'll and I'll show you something in a second. Uh, thing is, for, for Beta Ray Bill, I don't think really any of the other world bosses matter that much because you just one shot them anyways, right? Um, so it's it's mainly for Null. And um, okay, so Danger Room, I I think roughly, you know, beat down, you know, is 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 better. It's not that much better though for for Danger Room, um, at least from what I can see so far. If I get any additional info i'll share that with you guys but um it seems like you shouldn't go out of your way to put beat down on it just for danger room now for world boss for null okay as as i mentioned earlier in the video um it took me about i played for like 50 minutes i'll say it, it, at least clearing stage 21 um beta ray bill was on the team today so after I after I you know I, I did the changes you know I I, I ran into to null excuse me I did a couple runs and I cleared it on my second try stage 22 and I didn't have a whole lot of time left I'll, I'll show you the I'll show you the image right here I I did it with nine seconds left and you know you saw it didn't seem like there was like that much of an increase in damage it seemed like maybe a bar right at most for doing the the awaken rotation and then the rotation right after the you know five three four but you know it 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 must have just stacked up or you know it just kind of kind of gets a little bit better you know throughout the run um you know it's like a progressive type type of um improvement and it just it made it made it so much easier and i'm gonna say this here and i'm gonna make this statement okay so I know when I did the comparison for Universals, right? I just did Odin Sentry in in Ghost Rider, and after switching up the rotation with with Odin, Odin's definitely Odin's definitely better. He moved he moved up the ranks um, a little bit. He's he's pretty much like I mean they're all very similar. Odin Sentry and Ghost Rider. You can you can basically interchange those those three, but Sentry needs a Sentry needs a forge energy or he, he might not need forge energy but he definitely needs an energy um but i'm gonna say this beta ray bill is going to be the most important character he is in my opinion he's he's the best for null best character for null and not solo because the thing is you, you don't you don't run these teams solo right like for this run like it's constant in and out swapping you got to get real creative you got to be on point with everything your procs have to work if you want to be able to clear it um and yeah 
Beta Ray Bill, he's going to be your saving grace. He's going to be able to carry you up to higher stages like, you know, once you ever get to, um, you know, stage, uh, you know, 20 to through 25, he's going to be, he's going to be your go-to guy because you can't use him for 15 through 20. Um, it's only human, um, but you can use him for, all right, yeah, because it's male. Yeah, you can use him through 10 through 10 through, um, yeah, let me, let me, let me, let me check. Why, why am I, I'm having a complete brain fart right now. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, it's just, it's just male characters. I knew that. So, but yeah, he, he's going to be your guy. He's going to be, if, if you're like, you know, brand new account or, you know, lower spender or whatever, um, you're going to want Beta Ray Bill, Okay. You know, get an energy on that guy, and, and but you're gonna want to kind of combo him with somebody else because you want to swap in and out. That that's that's the way to do it. And like I mentioned, I'll, I'll try to come up with something, maybe some kind of guide, or you know, I'll just make a video showcasing exactly you know what I do because I have to imagine for people that don't have their accounts, but you know, don't have like Pierce on their cards and all that. You know, my stage 22 is equivalent to somebody's stage five or something like that, right? So I'll try to do something to uh, help you guys out in that sense. But so there it is. There it is. I, I hope maybe, you know, this answers some 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 questions for, for some people. Maybe it got something out of the video. Um, and that's fantastic. That's what it's all about. So if you have any information or anything that I missed, anything you want to share, hit me up in the comments, guys. Until next time, I'll catch you later. Peace.